Lainey's wrapped up warm. <laughs> it's time for another adventure. It's the it's the best time of year. It's autumn. It well, is. Kind of autumn, isn't it? It's getting there, yeah. I think it's it's only just started getting cold the last like two three weeks. So all the trees are starting to go brown now. So yeah, best time for a walk. And red. Yeah, Got where are we? Autumn outfit on. Where are we adventuring today then, Lainey? Weem Forest. Weem Forest. Welcome to Weem Forest. So you've been around here I think once before, it was a while ago. Mm -hmm. I used to come around here all the time with like my cousins and stuff. But the path now it says you go that way, but we used to go up this way. What way do you want to go? That way looks a bit creepier doesn't it? Oh, let's go this way. Will we follow the actual path? Oh, the arrows. Excellent, let's go. Okay, let's go. And then, of course, we'll go for a cup of tea. So oh, of course. We'll probably have to sit outside. Yeah, we'll the, see. The new rules and regs. Probably a spot of lunch as well. There's a lot of local options, so we'll There's we'll see what... Gary's so posh. She's like, a spot of lunch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a spot of luncheon. Uh, I am okay, not... let's get a wee cup of tea. I am not posh in the slightest. <laughs> common as muck. I'm common. Pretty common. <laughs> well, everyone up here is like, you, you sound so common. No, everyone up here is you sound so posh. No, everyone up here talks like so posh and I'm like, hi guys. <laughs> <laughs> Nice tree, eh? Yeah. See, when you're like in the woods and stuff, do you not just think of like TV programs like Marilyn and like. I always think of like Lord of the Rings and stuff. I'm such yeah. a big geek. The Witcher. Oh, The Witcher. Henry Cavill does do that a lot as The Witcher, I must say. <laughs> mm. Mm. Centered. <laughs> <laughs> Fan, big fan. Big fan, big fan. What about Henry Cavill? Who doesn't? I was like, Mum, if I was single, I'd actively seek Henry Cavill out and ask him to marry me. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding on. <laughs> Don't even know what to say. Yeah. Though. I'd probably I'm be the same, to be honest. honest. <laughs> <laughs> it's time for everyone's favourite segment, Fun Facts with Gary. So we're in Weem Woods. Wood, Weem Woods. Weem Weem Woods. Woods. The womb of Weem. I said Woods. <laughs> you said Womb. Weem in Old Scots comes from Womb. Oh, <laughs> Literally there you go. it sounds like Womb. Um, and that means cave. And it's called cave because in the hills here, at Weem Rock, there's lots of rocks that have got caves in them. And it's believed to be that there's lots of like dragons and demons that live in the, the woods up here. So like if you ever do come here. Bring lots, a sword. <laughs> bring a sword as well. A sword and a shield. <laughs> But lots of the rocks have got carvings of dragons and stuff in them. So there used to be lots of like log carvings, but I think most of them have rotted away. But someone's done some amazing stone ones, so we'll get lots of clips of them as we go around as well. They're very, very cool. That's so cool, I can't wait to see those. I love stuff like that. And also, I can see on this tree behind you that people have, you know, marked their love. Oh, isn't that lovely? And there's so one over there, there as, as well. well. Isn't that cute? Yeah. Are you going to carve a tree for me? Uh, I would, but you know, that's, that's vandalism and, you know. Aww. Sorry, I'm still getting over the fact that womb means cave. It's not womb, it's oom. Oh, oom. Alright. Okay. Oh, 
You going in? Yeah. There's not really a uh, like two bits of The fairies come to drink. I do believe in fairies. I do. I do. <laughs> See it, Gary. I do believe in fairies. I do. I do. So there's another pool just along there, Lady. That's in this little cave bit. This is called Saint David's Well. Oh. So why it's called Saint David's Well? I say David went there. Uh, he, yeah, you're not wrong. <laughs> so Saint David, he was actually a part of Clan Mingus. So you know the castle down there mm -hmm. that we we saw alone. We'll put a little clip in just now so everyone can see if they didn't know what it was. So it's a local kind of castle, and in the, I think the 15th century, the son of the Laird's guy called David, Sir David, and he didn't want to be a lord with all the kind of houses and lands and stuff. So he came up here and started living in the caves. Um, and like a kind of hermit lifestyle to try and be closer to God. And this is St. David's Well. So he's coming for a wee drink. In fact, there's actually a little plaque up here. For a wee berry. That explains it. A wee berry. There we go. Oh, yeah, and also uh, St. Cuthbert is believed to have, have stayed in the caves up here as well. So he's one of the, the original missionaries that brought Christianity to Scotland back in the time of the Picts. Do you want to have a drink from Big David's well? Not really. Not really? Why not? I didn't bring my filter. You didn't bring your filter? I'll, I'll be set. <laughs> Probably stagnant water and all that. Gary, you're going to get Legionella or something. No! <laughs> Does it taste nice? It just tastes of water. And you get a nice view across Strath Tea and Aberfeldy. You can just see it through the trees there. Let's see if we can see our house. Okay. I can see my house from here. <laughs> I can see my house from here. Um. I don't know if I'm seeing them. Nice, yeah. I see it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I see it. <laughs> Check you can sleep in that little cave there. Gary, I can sleep anywhere. Yeah, I suppose that's kind of true. You I mean, literally like sit down five minutes later you're asleep, so... Yeah, you'd have no worries. That cave looks absolutely pristine. It the does. best place to sleep. Look at it. Isn't that really weird? No, oh, the rock's so that's strange, isn't it? Like so as you're on your way back down from St David's Well, the path goes down to the right, but if you go this little sneaky path off the left, Elaine, what will you find? More trees and more leaves. Correct. But the answer we're looking for is a rope swing. So, like I said, I'm not been here in a while, but growing up there always used to be an amazing rope swing through this bit. So I think Mike will have our uh, our brew break. Bolly Mike will have a brew break through here, and if there's a little swing, we'll have a wee shot on it. What? Oh, there's a red squirrel. What a spot, lady! Oh my goodness. Here we see the red squirrel in its natural habitat. Good spot. What a leap! What a leap! I know what an absolute champion. The swing is still there. Woo! <laughs> Top tip from the locals, if you're up Weem Rock, go on the wee side path. Literally the best place to have a picnic and a little break. And if you've got Wayne, she can chuck her in that swing and then swing her about. <laughs> Keep going. <Woo! laughs> I'm a bit heavier than I used to be.
graceful. I want to swing from the chandelier, chandelier. Oh, the memories. <laughs> Are you having a good time over there? I, I feel like a child again. You look like you're having fun. Just you stay there as long as you want. Woo! I think it's time for tea though. Perfect 10 out of 10 this mount. Kind of conk. We conquer. Whoop. Attacking you. Well, we call them conkers. I saw. Was it a horse chestnut? Isn't it? Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. I think it's these chestnuts, <laughs> though. I think these are actually poisonous. Are they? I think so. Anyway. And then you put you tie them up on strings, and then you like play. Conkers. I have a game of conkers. Yeah. Oh, 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 I dropped it. Elaine, you're being watched. It's a dragon! <laughs> it's awesome. eye, it's so cool. It looks kind of more like a velociraptor. I was actually thinking it looks a bit velociraptor -y. It looks like, like blue out of the new ones. Mm -hmm. Keep your eye out, Laney. This is dragon country now. Okay. Don't worry, I'm. I know how to. I know how to tame them. You know how to tame them? Oh, you've seen how to train your dragon? You just need a stinky fish or something, do you know? No, it's just looking at Or you at tickle me. them under the chin. I just have the words with the spirit within me. Alright, are you on the dragonborn? Yeah. <laughs> I don't you get that reference, do you? <laughs> Skyrim. <laughs> I worked for Bellathor at the general goods store. Well, I have played Skyrim. That's fair enough. That's fair enough. Any more dragons sighted, Aline? Not yet. Not yet. Still on the lookout. I think that they know that they are no match for me. They know that you've got them beat. Yeah. Might be that, yeah. Alright. You know what I mean? You're, do you feel safe with me? Yeah, I've not seen a dragon the whole time I've been <laughs> with you, Elaine. Well, now you know why. Elaine, this is a bit awkward. Oh, is that it's a dragon fossil, is that what it is? Because that's where I put him. That's where you put him. Oh, This used to be a dragon as well, lady. So you know how I said there used to be wood carvings? This used to be a dragon here. So that's like its front arm and its back arm and its tail. And they used to have a wee pot of money and used to like put pennies in it. But it's all just... Rotted away. Oh, that's sad. It's a childhood memory gone forever. Recarve it. I might do. I might just have to commit to learning how to carve logs whittling. and then doing that. I'll get whittling. Whittling. So, Lenny, I think this is the second time you've been around to Wheem Woods. Uh -huh. What do you think? I love it. You love it? I love it. It is a nice walk, isn't it? It's a bit steep up in parts, but it's only like a mile. Yeah. It's like an hour long walk, not even that 45 minutes. Feels adventure I like how just like in the middle of nowhere it feels. Mm -hmm. And it's like you're properly like away from society. It's, it makes me sound really weird, but you know what I mean? It's like wilderness kind of stuff. Just love the forest. I know what you mean. And we're almost back to the start. Here she comes. She's dragging herself, look at her.
Incredible work. Do you remember the proposal? I do. We filmed yeah. the proposal with Sandra Bullock and um, Ryan Reynolds. Ryan Reynolds. Yeah. And his grandma's like in the woods going like this. And then she goes to the window, to the wall. I don't say the next bit because it's rude. Yeah. And on that note, lady, will we sign off? Oh, yeah, signing off. Signing off. Farewell. And we'll see you again soon. Cheers, guys. Bye.